Your nervous system acts to receive information from the outside world and make decisions on how to act or react in order to stay safe. For example, if you're crossing the road and you see a car coming, your eyes receive the information and the brain decodes it. The brain then makes a decision that if your body stays where it is, it will probably get hit by the car. So it sends a signal to the motor units at the muscles of your legs to contract and move you away from the danger. In this scenario, the brain has made a conscious decision to react in relation to a stimulus by receiving and processing information and then consciously taking a course of action. There is also an involuntary part of the nervous system that assists with reacting to surroundings. This is known as the autonomic nervous system. The autonomic nervous system is made up of two sides, the sympathetic and the parasympathetic. The sympathetic nervous system can increase your heart and breathing rate. It can also stimulate the release of hormones like adrenaline and cortisol. It's commonly termed your fight or flight response. When your body is under stress, it will stimulate the sympathetic side of the autonomic nervous system. For example, if your work and home life are both stressful, you will constantly stimulate the sympathetic nervous system, which can leave you feeling run down. The parasympathetic nervous system is commonly termed the rest and digest system. It is utilized best when you're relaxing, meditating, stretching, getting a massage or a facial, or taking your dog for a walk.